The following video clips show the transport of chyme along the proximal colon and the filling of the colonic coil. Contrast medium was infused at the beginning of the second colonic loop. A peristaltic wave reaches the colonic loop, propelling chyme towards the colonic coil. At the beginning of the coil, the peristaltic wave becomes a giant contraction, propagating along the centripetal loops of the coil. The giant contraction is preceded by a marked aboral relaxation. The contraction propagates over long distances of the colonic coil, thereby filling the coil with chyme. Once the wave has passed the intestinal loops, stationary contractions separate the digester into boli. A further peristaltic wave starts within the proximal colon, propelling chyme distally. It enters the colonic coil and propagates along the centripetal loops of the coil. The digester present in the loop are only slightly displaced distally. The new digester mainly increase the volume of the coil. Now the peristaltic wave reaches the flexure of the coil and continues along the centrifugal loops. Again, when the peristaltic wave has passed a loop of the coil, segmenting contractions recur, dividing the content of the coil into small boli.